Hi, ever lost your phone and realized it's turned off? Panic sets in, right? But what if I told you there might still be hope? Stay tuned to discover how you can potentially locate your lost Android phone that is powered down. When your phone is on, locating it is straightforward with built-in services like Google's Find My Device and Samsung Find My Mobile, provided you have logged into your account and enabled these features in advance. But once it's off, things get tricky. Once your phone is shut off, traditional network and GPS-based location methods, including the offline find features from Google and Samsung, won't work. Right now, we can only locate devices with an independently powered Bluetooth low energy, the LE chip. Currently, this type of chip is available in the Google Pixel 8 9 series and OnePlus 13 series. In the future, it's expected that more Android brands will adopt this technology. So, if your missing device is one of these models, you're lucky. Even when it's turned off, you can still use Find My Device to get its real, time location. What if you are using other models? Don't worry, there's still hope. The built-in features can show the last known location before it was off. If it hasn't been long since the loss, go to there to have a look quickly. Also, try to recall where you lost the phone. If it was in a place with cameras like a mall or a restaurant, contact staff to check security footage. It might show who took it or where it was left. This isn't direct tracking, but it's a vital clue. Lastly, every phone has a unique IMEI number, like an ID. You can find it on the phone's box, report it to the police. They might track it when it reconnects to the network, depending on their policies. In summary, while finding a powered off phone is challenging, acting quickly and using these tips can make a difference. For future peace of mind, consider installing AirDroid Parental Control to track your child's phone in real time. It will alert you if your child's phone battery is low. It also helps you see and hear your child's surroundings. Found this video helpful? Give it a thumbs up and share it with friends. Subscribe for more tips and see you in the next video.